Today it's time for some alien fishing in this brand new VR fishing game, Galactic Catch. Hey what's up, I'm Matt and welcome to BMFVR, your unofficial home for all things Quest. Today we're checking out Galactic Catch, a brand new VR fishing game. A huge shout out and thank you to the developers for supporting the channel and sponsoring this video. Let's jump in and catch some alien fish. Hey what is up and welcome to my Galactic Fish Aquarium in Galactic Catch. That's right, when you catch fish, you can come and put them in a galactic aquarium. Plus, you can customize it, too. You can actually add in all the fish that you've caught. You can do decorations, so you earn decorations. You can actually move them around in this little grid here. Put them wherever you want. And you can even change the background. I've got Beach Bay on right now. You can turn that off and just have a regular aquarium. I much prefer that one. I'd like to unlock some more. And you can actually have multiple aquariums. So, see, so you can actually have three different aquariums with 40 fish capacity, you can swap the fish out, these are all the fish that you can catch and earn. I really want to catch some of these bigger ones, the billy shark, that <laughs> just sounds hilarious. And when you want to go catch some more fish, you just head over here to the menu system, and this is the planet here. Right now, I've got a couple of stages unlocked, I want to be able to get this one unlocked today, that's my goal right now. We're going to go to Shroom Lagoon, and then we'll check out Beach Bay in a little bit, just so you can see, I love the visuals for these planets. They're alien, but familiar, and they look really good. Let's go ahead and go do some fishing. Welcome to Shroom Lagoon. This huge mushroom's gonna cover everything in your sight. The water looks great. Let me just stand up here, I'm sitting down. That's, that's the best thing to do is to sit down and you're going fishing. This place looks really good. You've got a galactic fishing pole. I'm gonna take it in my left hand because I prefer to fish with my left hand and reel with my right. So this is your galactic fishing pole. It's actually got upgrades and stuff you can do to it. This little button here, when you go fishing and you press either the Y or B button, depending on which hand you're holding the reel in, it actually allows you to get a power up. When this fills, this is almost full now, you get a power up that allows you to reel the fish in really fast so you don't have to fight it. It's got an overlay in the game that's very similar to other uh, VR fishing games that you can see the fish and you're gonna cast just like you would in a regular fishing game. To change the lure, you use your analog stick. You can have different types of lures. Let's go ahead and catch a fish. We're gonna cast out here, and we're gonna pull this fish in really quick. Let's just let it grab onto it really quick. That little dot out there, that yellow dot, there we go. It's gonna say that uh, that indicates where your line is, but your line will actually get more tense and it'll turn color, so you'll have to Move your, uh, oh, 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 you have to move your reel back and forth to be able to tire the fish out. And you'll see the line turns green when you can reel as fast in. It's kind of white when it's normal, and it's red when it's going to break. So you got to try to reel the fish in, just like you would in, a, in other uh, VR fishing games. But this is galactic fishing. You're going to catch alien fish. And some of these fish are really cool. They actually look really cool. Come on, you big one. Just because they're big, too. Oh, there, there it is. You want to see it? This is what happens when you push the button. Ready? Reels it in really fast. There we go. Nice. Look at that giant thing. That's a new one. Looks like a sponge. Angling for anglers. I got an angler fish. The imposter gumdrop. Whoa, that's funky looking, isn't it? Look, you can actually grab it and look at it. Turn it around. Flip it all over. Weird looking fish. Now we can put it in our uh, aquarium, though. So let's collect it. You'll earn different items, too, as you collect. You'll see. Some asteroids and some uh, nightcap spores. That means you can go in here and you can actually do crafting. This will allow you to craft new lures, power-ups, um, the aquarium background. We need one more nightcap spore to get the aquarium background, and that's what you're going to do with these different items that you procure by catching fish. So this is an aquarium decoration, more decorations, and this allows you to do power-ups. This is 30% weight of a large and extra-large paradisium fish. Different things like that. So as you earn these items, you can craft them. You just hit craft. And this is the best for angler fish. I'm going to actually get that because the goal of this level is to actually get angler fish. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and try that again. We're going to go ahead and catch another one. This is, uh, so this is best for angler fish. So let's go ahead and get an angler fish over there. That green one. There we go. Go ahead and grab it, you green dotted fish. There we go. Come on. Something just so relaxing about fishing. And I love VR fishing games, but something unique about this game that I really like is the alien setting and the alien fish. It makes it unique. Like, going fishing on planet Earth is awesome. And I think it's great, but it's just something spectacular about going fishing in a location that you would never see on Earth. Ooh, this little, look at this little tiny 
tiny thing right here. Let's see if we can get, unlock the next stage. We gotta catch three more angler fish. Yeah, I gotcha. All right, ooh, it's an angry fish. Look at it, it's angry. Angry eyes going on, there we go. Happy fish. You're happy to get caught. Ooh, look at that freaking big thing. You see that? Holy. Oh, I got a power up. All right, come on. But anyways, look at the reflections. I love the reflections of the water. Hi there, little buddy. Whoa, you're a beast. It is, this is a, oh, yeah, it is an uncommon rare epic fish. Cool, I gotta get three of those. What the heck is that thing? It looks like a mushroom. It is a mushroom. What the heck? It's a fungi fish. Fungi fish. All right, let's catch one more, shall we? This one might be a rare uncommon one. Let's reel this sucker in. Come on, we just need to get this last one. I think this is a more rare one. Yes, we did it, okay, good. Nice, collect. All right, that's another mission done. Nightcap spores. What does that do? Predator's Peak Hall. Catch five fish from Predator's Peak. Oh, we just unlocked Predator's Peak. Yes. Whoa, this place looks awesome. This is cool. You know what this looks like? And it might actually be. The same uh, developer that did this did a short with a bunny in it. You might have seen it called Invasion, I believe it's called. Yeah, this, this looks very similar to the lake from Invasion. New types of fish, maybe? Let's catch one. Let's see, I love this snowy thing. I know that there's a lava lake, too, at some point, which is going to be awesome. Go to a lava lake. There's a whole bunch of locations in this. Alien-style locations. After I catch this fish, I am going to go to the first place you get, though, because I want to show you how awesome that one looks. That's like a beach location. That's really cool. Come on, there we go. Come on, this thing's running. Then not, not want to get pulled in at all. My word. Oh man, what is this thing? Oh, I've caught that one before, I think. A gore fish. A gore fish? I don't know if I've caught that one or not. Okay, cool. We'll collect that one. All right, let's go add some stuff to our aquarium, and then we're going to go to the first level. All right, let's add some fish to our aquarium, so, shall we? We've got a whole bunch of ones. Let's add a green gumdrop. We've got two of those ones. I'm just gonna add all of them, right? We got a capacity of 40, so let's just add everything that we have to this aquarium. Got anything else? We got a gore fish. That was the first one of those that I've caught. Okay, cool. Look at that. We got a lot of fish going on in there now. Cool. All right, let's go to the other place and uh, and I'll show you what the beach fishing looks like. All right, this place is called Beach Bay. You got that really cool planet up there and the sky there in front of you, and you got a nice beach going on here. It looks like a giant starfish over there. Oh, there's another one right there. Some shells. And uh, that's where we were a little bit ago with the mushroom area. And uh, it's because it's on the same planet, but there are other planets that you go to that you unlock. And then you got little beach chairs right there. Let's see uh, what we can catch for a fish real quick. Ooh, there's some big ones over there. Uh, gotcha. All right, come on. I'm going to catch one fish here. Come on, come on, come on. Lots of different areas to fish on. Beaches. Caves. Ooh, whoa, this is an interesting looking one. An angler shark. Hi there, angler, angler shark, or angler shark, whatever you are. Angle, angler shark, yeah. Creepy looking thing, isn't it? There you go, that's three of the locations in Galactic Catch. I actually really enjoy fishing in this game. It's super relaxing and super unique. There you go, there is Galactic Catch on the Quest. There's a link down in the description if you want to check it out. Let me know down in the comments what you think of this. Are you going to become a Galactic Fisherman? Let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date on all things Quest. And happy questing.